Okay, so we got good ambiance. Let us continue our game. Here we go. So, when we ended last stream, we were attempting to advance the story. Now, in order to advance the story, we need to solve the puzzles in this cabin. And you might remember this guy over here. You might remember the slime friend. Okay? Let us let us refresh our minds on what we did. We defeated Leshy. We we fit, we discovered his name. This mysterious individual here is named Leshy. We know his name now. So we can see his name in game. We discovered that he uses a a a picture camera to capture souls into cards. Okay? And also these strange mushrooms have begun to show up all over the house, and we haven't discovered what these mushrooms are all about yet. We were able to free a wolf from this cage. We were able to solve the puzzles on the chest of drawers. We found the slime in a bottle. We, we, once we released the wolf, we were able to get the knife. And now we need to solve the picture. We need to solve the clock. And... We need to find a way out. Hmm. And to do that, we must play the game. So let us play. This is a fresh run. We Now, if you'll recall, we received this hook. This is a gift from the angler. This will allow us to steal one card. So that's going to be very helpful. We have a free hook that we can steal overpowered cards with because the angler wants us um, to fight. Yeah, we need to find the third friend. We're missing the third talking card. Can you try to steal the moon? I've never tried to steal the moon. I don't think you can. I don't think you can steal the moon because I think that uh, you can't use it after defeating the angler. We could try. Do you want to try and steal the moon? I've never tried to steal the moon. Go left? Yeah, let's go left. Here we go. Let's begin. Let's start playing. We'll settle in and get comfy. Birds, bugs, or wolves? I want to do bugs. I want to do a bug deck. Can we do a bug deck? Let's do a bug deck. The invi inviolable beehive. When it is attacked, you will draw a bee. We have full items, so going here would be a waste. And the trapper is over here, which would be good. So, here is a sacrifice. <laughs> we could put in the weasel. <laughs> Your choice. We could put in the stink bug. Hello. Or... We could put in the wolf. Now, personally, I love buffing the weasel. But I hate him. So we're going to buff the stink bug. Let's put the beehive into the stink bug. Because the stink bug is a defensive card and will benefit. Yeah, he's more square. Isn't that weird? Notice that the art changed. Have you guys noticed that? Our weasel... Our weasel, or our stoat, sorry, stoat, isn't that weird that his head looks so strange? And also, so does the stink bug. The stink bug has a different face than before. It used to be a bug. Very odd. Yeah, it is more square. And also, he has this weird little thing over here. His cheeks are different. Yep, he's got different cheeks. Very weird. <laughs> the, the stoat has a chad neck. That's true, he does. Let's do this elite fight. Maybe they're turning into people. All right, so we got two empowered birds. That's kind of obnoxious, but not the worst thing in the world. Let's get the squirrel out and we'll get the stoat out right away. <laughs> Keep me alive. <laughs> Keep me alive. You think the stoat's gonna turn into a neckbeard? We'll find out, I guess. 
Now we can put a bullfrog down here, which would be very good because a bullfrog can leap up and blant and block these. Would stoat disappear forever if sacrificed? No. Um, there are only very certain cards that disappear forever. It's very, very rare. There we go. Average bullfrog fan versus average stout enjoyer. <laughs> This is a level one elite fight. Remember, we just started a new game, so don't, don't, like, if this seems easy, this is because this is the first elite fight of the game. Look at that, we got some extra teeth already. That's great. The fact that cards have personalities is so big, big brained. Just you fucking wait. Just you fucking wait. You won't find any cheaper spelts within a hundred miles. Look at these pelts. Take one. We want the golden pelt. Yeah, we had. Oh, we had this horrible deck. Um, can we try my colleges gold pelts again? That strat was a banger. Yeah, we can. We can get two gold pelts. We'll get two gold pelts and a rabbit pelt. Now, the last game that we played, we were overwhelmed with pelts, and it was painful. It was truly painful. Much appreciated. But we won't have that problem this time. Now, if we go this way, well, we don't need items, so I think this path is not the right path. However, the wood carver would be very valuable. Going to the wood carver would allow us to get enhanced squirrels very early in the game. So I think even though this is a wasted square, we should go this way. Even though we're going to get a wasted square here. Hmm. You can't take more than three items and you already have three. Instead, perhaps you'll accept this gift from my friend. <gasps> a mouse! A rat! Hi, rat! Yay! The prudent pack rat. Never doubt the utility of a well-stocked pack. Thanks, rat. Thank, thank you, Leshy's friend. Pack rat is op. So pack rat gives you free cards when you when it when it dies. You get a bunch. Of, wait, wait. Sorry, sorry. No, wait. Sorry. Pack rat gives you free items when it dies. Look, trinket bearer. When a card bearing this sigil is played, you will receive a random item so long as you have less than three items up such a good card holy shit it's so good you get items it's it's even better than the card one I, I i know why i got it confused with the card one you'll understand in time every time it's played yes but it costs two blood which kind of sucks that's okay though watch this here's what we're gonna do we're gonna use it right away let's get that pack rat right out there huh look at that Ooh, free squirrel watch <laughs> you sure? Ooh, that's a that's an overpowered pronghorn. What the fuck? Oh boy. A wolf. Let's do this. Let's get the wolf out instead of the stone. Oh, come on. <laughs> Boom, boom. Ah, beautiful. Nice, easy kill. Now we get to choose a blood cost card. I think we should do bones. I'm feeling playing bones this time. Bugs and bones would be so much fun. Let's do a bones. Okay, we got a simple bones card. You have no idea what's happening? Don't worry, you'll learn as time goes on. I try to explain things. So now we're gonna go to the wood carver and we're gonna buff our squirrels, hopefully. Hopefully, our squirrels are bugs. 
you came upon the old woodcarver who fixed her intense gaze upon you. After an overlong moment of silence, she moved to offer her carvings. So we have the squirrel head. <gasps> Unkillable. When a card bearing this sigil perishes, a copy of, his, of it is created in your hand. That means eternal squirrels. That is so ridiculous. We have to take that one. Yes. The gray-haired woman silently collected her carvings and left. Does sacrifice count as perish? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. A third elite fight. Okay, let's do another elite fight. Ah, against wolves. That's not good. I hate fighting wolves. Undying. We got the squirrel. We, oh shit, I played that wrong. Oops, I messed up there. It's okay. It's okay, we'll get another one. So, so here we go. Now we go like this. We put the rabbit pelt here. Then we put a squirrel here and a squirrel here. And then we're gonna sacrifice. Look at that! Look at those squirrels! Oh, it's so ridiculous. We got a scissor. We got a free scissor from the pack rat. Holy shit. Ow. So now we have two squirrels and we can get a wolf out right away. Yep, as long as we got the space, we can summon an animal. It's fucking sick. That that is so good. I can't even believe it. I'm so excited. Great draw. Here we go. A bee. Also, notice you're in a loop of blood and bone sacrifices. That's very good. That means we can get really strong bones cards. This is a bo a beautiful bones deck. Oh, intentions nasty. You have no idea. You have no idea. We're definitely getting more bones. Another coyote. Ugh. But we'll do a bones deck. We've never played a bones deck. Your pack was full, but a small critter approached. Pack rat. Always useful. Two motherfucking pack rats. <laughs> Two motherfucking pack rats! a massive empty bowl surrounded by heaps of giblets and scantlings. Notice the dialogue is still fresh. We are on our fourth playthrough and we have not encountered reused dialogue for the bosses. They have written so much dialogue in this game for the bosses it's ridiculous. It seemed the bowl was designed for a dog. But what earthly hound would require a meal of that size? Where's that hound of mine? A lucky draw. <laughs> Boss time, eh? Squirrel out. Look at this shit. Yeah, Babinska, good to see ya. Two coyotes. See, this is the only problem. We're getting blood block, or we're getting a uh, bone block. But that's okay. Let's see what we can pull off. So there we go. Now we have a whole bunch of bones, which means we can get a coyote out. Which is good. We don't want to put the wolf out. Okay, you do voices. The scales are tipping in spite of my opposition to anarchism as a rule of pragmatism. Stuart J. Atkinson, it's good to see you. I'm sorry I haven't responded to your DM yet. I did read it. Um, I'm very happy you're reconsidering certain things. <laughs> what do the squirrels sound like? Boop. <laughs> 
That's a squirrel. Okay, there you go. You get one bone per defeat. Unless it's a special creature, which we had a special creature. Now remember, we don't want to, we don't want to, um, we don't want to, uh, put too many cards out right now because, um, remember this boss, remember what this boss does. This boss will turn our cards into gold. So you want to use as few cards on the first stage as possible and more cards in the second stage. Yeah. It's important to remember the strategies of these characters. Otherwise, they really hurt. So we'll get a nice full card hand of cards. We could we could do this. This is something we could do. Phase two. Here we go. There's gold in them cards. Boom. 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 Gold! I've struck gold! There's his dog. So, what can we do? We can put the stink bug out. I think the stink bug is a good call here. So let's do this. My mule! Curse you! Get him! Boom! We don't have any singular sacrifice. Oh yeah, we do, we have a skunk. But the skunk isn't actually that useful for us here. The beaver is good, I guess. The rattler, wait, we can use the rattler, hold on. We can totally use the rattler. Here we go. There we go. Get the skunk out. Then we'll grab a wolf, we'll sacrifice both of these. We'll put the wolf down, then we'll put the rattler down. Look at that. Woo! Beautiful. Yeah, we'll do some... Listen, Stuart J. Atkinson, you stick around. I talk about anarchism and stuff all the time. We can talk about that in the future. Baba Booey. We're gonna kill him in one turn. Watch, ready? Boom, boom! Yeah! Mwah! Beautiful. Oh, the cleanup. We're, we're plowing through this boss. You will not perish quite yet. Get those extra teeth? Yeah, fuck yeah. Perhaps one of these will entice you. The amorphous amoeba. Its sigils are ever-changing. The douse. The mole man. We gotta do the douse. The extra teeth do give you things. The more extra teeth that you collect, the more you can trade with the trapper and the trader, which is very valuable. You'll understand in time. The extra teeth let you get super rare cards if you play your hand right. <laughs> get it? The douse. I gotta show you the douse. It's so cool. Such a cool card. Wiping the dust from your trousers, you return to your journey. Let me see. Tepid water flooded your boots. Flies swarmed around you. You had entered the wetlands. Well, we have an obvious choice here. Hmm. This is actually very good. An undying bones card. But... This mushroom here lets us know that we could use the bullfrog in the future. Yeah, for those of you who don't know, we discovered this last time. If a mushroom pops up next to a card, it means you have a duplicate. Which, there's a certain character who loves duplicate cards. So we could take the bullfrog and go for the duplicate thing. Or we could take the more synergistic cockroach. I actually kind of think the bullfrog would be a good call here. Because we could get a buffed bullfrog that would be really strong. Duplicates, well, certain types of duplicates are very rare. Yeah, let's do the bullfrog. 
Yeah, let's do the bullfrog. Now, we definitely don't need another pack rat. We could remove a card, but we don't really have anything we need to remove. So why don't we empower something? Let's go over here. We could might go the gold pelts, that's true. The crackling fire lit the starving faces of a group of survivors. We have not food, one said. But perhaps one of your creatures will join us, enhance its power, said another. <laughs> Choose wisely. Nope! 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 No! I think we should buff the douse, personally. Or stink bug? Oh, stink bug would be good. It is getting stacked. Hi. The the bull the this one would be good. So let's do this one. If on each round you're a new soul for Leshy to steal, why does the stoat and stink bug remember you? You'll have to find out. This is only two bones, yeah. So let's do it. The fire warmed the weary stink bug and enhanced its power. You suspected the intentions of the survivors were less than pure. With your stink bug in tow, you retreated into the woods. Now we got a buffed stink bug. And we gotta do a fight. Let's do this fight. Mm. Ooh, there's a trial! Squirrel! Two kingfishers. Okay. We can get the we can put the bullfrog out to block damage right away. That's good. And we can put this squirrel out. And we can get a bone. Wait, we can't. No, this won't block it. So never mind. That's good. Boink. Blocked. Here we go. Oh, pack squirrel. Okay, wait, 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 wait. So wait, before we play the pack rat, because we have three items, we need to use the knife. Wait, we're gonna win. Oh shit, no wait, that means we win. Oops. I'm sorry. I imagine you'd like to replace that eye you lost. Well, I always like the double eye, so let's take the double eye. Happy with that one. So wait, why can't we find what's happening right now? We haven't been able to find the third talking friend. Why? Why haven't we found the friend? Isn't that a bit odd? We solved all of these. Oh, we need to do the painting. Okay, we need to do the painting, yeah. Yeah, I don't know why the magic eye's not there. I know there's supposed to be a magic eye, but it's okay. Black goat and a squirrel. Okay, this actually isn't that hard. We can do this. We just need to get a black goat. This is an easy one. Wait, hold on. <clears throat> ah, you're still curious. The first step would be getting those cards in your deck. We need to get a black goat. Let's do the trial, though. This trial is a good idea. Yeah, the cum jar. You gotta, you gotta careful. Avoid the cum jar, apparently. We're not allowed to use the cum jar. We were forbidden. The trial of kin. Two of the three drawn cards must be kin to pass. The trial of bones. The three drawn cards must cost at least. Oh wait, sorry, I'm doing the wrong voice. Sorry, I gotta do the I gotta do the snake voice. The trial of bones. The three drawn cards must cost at least five bones combined to pass. The trial of wisdom. The three drawn cards must have at least three sigils among them to pass. Well, we want bones. We're doing a bones deck. Bones has got to be the answer. Do we even have enough bones, though? Yes, we do. Let's do bones. Let the trial of bones begin. 
Coyote. Douse. Oh! Zero, four from the coyote. Zero from the douse. Zero from the golden belt. Failure. Shit. Oh, we missed a mycologist over here too. Oops. The pelt fucked us. It's okay. Black goat, black goat. That was a black goat. Wait, we can get the black goat. We got the black goat. We got this shit. We got this shit. Oh no. Hold on, hold on. This stump is in the way. How the hell do we get the stump out of the way? Can we cut the stump? Can you cut this stump? No, you can't. You can't cut the stump. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, we're gonna have to hope an enemy spawns over there and kills the stump. We can't put that down because it'll die. So, we have to just wait. Yeah, an enemy. Okay, good. There's an enemy coming that'll kill it. Okay, that's good. Okay. So here's how we do this. First, we clear this enemy with the wolf. Then we wait. We have to be patient. Okay. We have enough squirrels. We have a golden pelt. So, hold on a second. We can put the stink bug here. No, wait, we have to make it match exactly. So here's what we, yeah, here's how we do it, yeah. Sacrifice the wolf. Oh my god! Look, it's a cute goat! Why is it a cute goat? Look at it! Wait, what? Why is it like this? It's so, it's got a little, it's got a little frill! Oh, it's the goat eye! It's because of the goat eye! Uh, it's horny to us because it's the goat eye. Oh my god. It's wearing lingerie because we put the goat eye in. Holy shit. I never even seen that before. Oh my fucking god. That is so cute. Ooh. Did you see that effect? We got it. We solved it. We solved the problem. That's good. And we got some bones. We'll put this here. Okay, let's do this. Uh, bye, goat. Oh, shit. Okay, let's kill this. I hope, I don't think the alternate goat will block prog progression. <laughs> Thankfully. Oh, our rat died. Ooh, we got another one though. Watch this. We can use this to snip. No, we'll snip this one. Wait. Now we're gonna win. Bing, 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 bing. Extra teeth. Fuck yeah. Fuck you. I'm actually not sure what that is. What the fuck? It has mirror da What does this even mean? I mean, obviously we have to take this one. We have to. What does mirror mean? Oh, you don't even know. Mirror. It, it doesn't tell us what it does. We have to figure it out. We have to get this one. Yeah, we have to. There's no no way around it. That's fucking sick. Let's go check the painting. Hey! It's a photograph. We got a potted plant? Uh Okay. Ow! Ow! Gorilla 
Someone did it! I knew I had stuff come out of that painting. Bring it here. <laughs> nice work. You solved the mysterious painting. For now. <laughs> what am I supposed to do with it? Oh. What? You could... You just... It just goes over here? What does this mean? Is this gonna... Bring it here? Is that what he said? Hmm, you've plucked that from the oil painting. You must not like the cards that I deal you. Fine. Wh what? Bruh. So we haven't figured out anything about this yet, have we? We found out 11 o'clock. If you set it to 11 o'clock, we know that it makes the cuckoo bird come out. But we haven't figured out how to do this, right? Have we? It's not, this is for the, this one works for the, um, only for the safe. So I don't know what we're supposed to do with this. I don't know what the time we're supposed to put it to is, right? We already got the ring from the bird, which lets us cheat at the end of the game. All right, well, let's continue for now, I guess. The warm light of a campfire was a welcome sight. Though the ten hungry eyes around it dampened the greeting. Warm a creature by the fire enhance its health. <laughs> we might finish chapter two tonight, Sober Flote, if we can get to it. Okay, I I'm sorry, but I want to buff this thing. The survivors were right about the fl Excuse me, about the flames. They had enhanced the creature's health. Spotting a few of the survivors drooling, you made a hasty retreat with your mirror tentacle. Ooh, we know its name! It's called a mirror tentacle! That thing is gonna kill. Alright, stinky bugs. That's not good. Ah, oh, great. Actually, that's gonna be hard for us, because we don't have high damage. We've got nothing here. Okay. Well, we want to take the damage, so... Wait, 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 you can do this. Yeah, and, but, well, also, we had the bones. We can block with the pelt, too. It's for bones. Alright. Okay. Alright. Now watch this. Let's get the douse out, shall we? Fish hook the ringworm? Wait, no, because it doesn't put it in our deck. It just lets us keep it for right now. But we want this mantis if we can get it. The mantis would be sick. But we're gonna put the douse out. Let's put the fucking douse out. Chime. Now watch this. Oh no, fuck, I fucked it up. Ah, I fucked it up. God damn it, I fucked it up. Shit. I goofed that up. It's okay. We're gonna need to pull one of these ants. There we go. This is a hard fight. Uh, is this- is this actually salvageable? Yeah, we could put a boulder over here and hope for the best. This is rough. We might- we might lose a life here. This is really rough. We don't have enough. You can't draw blood from a chime. 
So you're short. Oof. Rough. Ah! I did the wrong thing. Shit, I fucked up. Well, I deserve this one. I deserve this one. Shit, I fucked that up. I meant to pull a- I meant to pull a squirrel. It's alright, it's only one life. We, we have two lives, we have two lives. We're alright, we're alright. We got two lives. We're okay, we're okay. When will the worthy challenger appear? Hey, we already kicked your ass once, dude. Don't get cocky. Whoa! Oh! The plant lets you re-roll! Ooh, Rat King. Rat King. The, plat the plant lets you re-roll card choices. That's so awesome. Okay, let's figure out what we want. Well, we gotta power this guy up, right? Oh. We can dump the Rat King. We could dump the Rat King. Yeah, we could dump the Rat King into the tentacle. But the tentacle is strong. So maybe it would be better for us to put the Douse into it. Or we could get rid of one of the pack rats, which are expensive. Is it just me or does Leshy have Dom energy? 8D, 5D, 2D, Derek? Yes, that is actually correct. Unironically, yes. Unironically, yes. God, you're you are such a grouch today, Fawn. What? You're like, eh, eh, eh. Fawn is hating on us over here. The hater fawn. The traitor. Let's put Pack Rat onto it. Ah. What you first mistook for a misshapen boulder appeared to be a hulking man. You attempted to sneak past him, but your foot made contact with a metal bucket. I am the angler. You are the fish. Okay, so we will put the bullfrog out right away. And we'll get this thing out. Oh shit, I did that in the wrong order. Fuck. I did that in the wrong order. Wait, wait, wait. No, this is fine. Because we can put this squirrel back out. Always take cockroach, add its effect to your favorite cards. Yeah, that's a good idea. Actually, that is a good idea. The cockroach is strong. Excellent. Beautiful. Smells like fish. I saw the trophy thing you got. I've never seen that before, even on some deep dive secret vids. Yeah. We, that's because you can only get it with really good deck building, which I'm really good at deck building. I have played thousands of hours of deck builders. It's my favorite thing. One of my favorite game types is deck builders. Go fish. This is so bad. I love Magic the Gathering. I just haven't played it much lately. Okay, so we're gonna try out this card real quick. Try this. Go fish. Uh, 
Well, the good news is we can continuously block. That's very good. Because of this. Will this do enough damage? Let's find out. No. Okay, well, we can keep blocking for now. I got an idea. Let's use the frozen opossum here. This will buy us a turn to draw. Okay, we're gonna be able to draw this turn. Oh yeah, that's true, Miss Nibiru. That's true. I may have messed this up a little bit. Let's see what we can do here. Hey, we just barely pulled through. Oh, we barely pulled through. Whew. Let me relight your candles. We defeated the angler. All right. Perhaps one of these will entice you. Mole man, pack rat, amalgam, canine, hooved, reptilian, feathered, insectoid. The amalgam is all. We need the amalgam. We need the amalgam. I love the amalgam. The angler's foul stench slowly faded as you continued on. Hmm. Ah, yes. I know. Sheets of icy snow battered your body as you fought your way up to a vantage point. The snow-covered trees jutted from the landscape like prickly misplaced teeth. You continued on through the snow line. Hey, it's the traitor! Show me some exquisite pelts. Hair pelts. Holy shit, the moose buck is strong. We don't need infinite sacrifices. A bat could be useful to us. Oop, Eldritch God subs, what's up? <laughs> the bull moot, the moose buck could be good. The bat might be better. We do have a bone deck. And a flying bat could be very useful to us. I think we'll take the bat, and we'll take the moose. The poghorn, okay. I do like the poghorn. Hmm. Yeah, let's do the poghorn. Golden pelt. Is that a, a golden pelt? Magnificent. Mantis god! Oh, and the Ouroboros. Okay, I learned something about the Ouroboros. I, I learned something about the Ouroboros. We have to get the Ouroboros, and we have to get the Mantis God. You have my gratitude. We do have 8 billion pack rats. That's true. Let's do this. Let's sacrifice an animal. You came across some familiar stones, but there was definitely something different intuited that the fate of the creature selected for this would not be pleasant. <laughs> Should we sacrifice the mantis god? You want to sacrifice stoat? You want to sacrifice stoat? Pick something else. <laughs> we can sacrifice anything. I don't know what happens if you sacrifice Mantis God. It's so op. Mixed Dizzy, that makes me so happy. All right, we're fucking the stoat. Fuck you, stoat. <laughs> Bad play. Ah! You callously slaughtered the stoat. However, the Bone Lord was pleased by your sacrifice. 
a minor boon of the Bone Lord. You will start each battle with one extra bone. You shook off the viscera of the poor stoat and carried onwards. Ah, little animal! What's this? Hey, look! Look who showed up! Wait, I wonder what happens if you listen- I wonder what happens if you listen to this guy and you put the plant here instead. I don't know. Can you pick it back up? You can't, can you? You can't. Hmm, strange. Let's continue. Elite fight. Boom. We get a free bone, and we get a free squirrel. Okay, well, the obvious answer is to put this dude out here real quick. Look at this crazy first turn we're about to get. We're about to get three cards out on the first turn. <laughs> Oops. I put a squirrel out. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Of course I sacrificed the stoat. He's a little bastard. Of course I'm gonna sacrifice the stoat. Let's see. Hey, I think we might be able to make this. We might actually make this happen. The Rat King. Um, yes! Douse is a cool card. I like it. I think it's fun, but it has some problems. And I'll explain what they are in a little bit. You'll see. Grime Dango! We got Grime Dango again! Always have to take Grime Dango, the most overpowered card we've ever created. And the mycologist is over here. We have to go to the mycologist. Okay, we're going to mycologist. We're going to mycologist. It's okay. Grime Dango's busy tonight. I think buffing this card would make it very valuable. I did see the clover, but I didn't need I didn't want to use the clover cuz cuz we had we had a great card. I can never turn down Grime Dango. It is so uh, unbelievably Wait, Zipply? What the hell is Zipply? I've never even heard of that. I'll have to take a look into it. The clover lets you reroll the cards. Yeah, it lets you re-roll them. Bones. The squirrel. Okay. We don't have enough to use any of this. This is not good. Okay. So one's gonna get blocked. Two's gonna get blocked. Okay. All right, well, whatever. We just gotta take some damage the first turn. Grime Dango, we just got your card again. Grime Dango, your card has carried us so many times it keeps showing up again. It's it's unbelievable. It's actually amazing. Genuinely incredible. Okay. 
get the coyote out first, and then we'll go from there. Okay, that's strong. Okay, elks are scary, okay? The amalgam. Oh shit, I forgot amalgams count as squirrels! So they have undying automatically. Oh my god, that's so ridiculous. Oh no, the elk's gonna get it. Oh, I killed our, it killed our animal. It's all right, we'll be fine. We got the douse. The douse actually isn't very useful here. The bat is more useful. Wait, but we need more bones. So I guess we could go like this. Oops. Whatever. I f See, this is why the douse can be a little bit difficult. Salutations. What? I didn't mean to use that. Shit. Let's get the bat out. It's okay. A rabbit? Why the hell is there a rabbit? Oh my god. You're right, Falgaia. You can sacrifice the amalgam and a squirrel, summon a squirrel, then resummon amalgam for crazy bone generation. Holy shit, you're actually right about that. So what's the lore of this game, or is it just a spooky card game? We're still trying to find that out. We're only in the first chapter of the game. So as far as we know, we're just playing a spooky card game. <gasps> we're about to hit the mycologist, and we got a pronghorn. We're taking the pronghorn. We can make a double pronghorn. <laughs> Did you bring us two of the same? like to experiment. The prong horn, prong horn, prong horn, prong horn. Look at all these mushrooms. We're gonna do this one though. You may want to avert your eyes. You now have but one pronghorn. Is it stronger? We have a a a, a fucking sewn together pronghorn now, which is fucking awesome. So we got a mantis god. We can put the mantis god out right away. Here's where we're gonna put the mantis god. If you put mantis god right here, it can't. It's not gonna be hit, which is really good. And, if we use our squirrel card, we can get a wolf out, too, while we're at it. Mantis God. Mantis God. Mantis God. We won one turn. One turn victory. Beautiful. Fucking beautiful. Let's refresh. I'm not a huge fan of any of these, really. Maybe we should do a moose buck. I think we're gonna do a moose buck. I think we should go for the sacrifice. The moose buck pushes other cards to the side, so it will it will rotate all of your cards, not just itself. So you know how the elks like sh uh, go to the side like this. Um, the, the moose buck will, uh, shove all cards in that direction, which is very interesting. Okay. Personally, we need to get... We could put... Okay, so I want to use the Ouroboros. Hmm. Hmm. 
We should buff Grime Dango, though. But what? <gasps> Wait a minute! We can give Grime Dango trifurcated strike if we sacrifice the Mantis God into Grime Dango. What could be better than a two-hit Grime Dango, but a three-hit Grime Dango? Yep, we're buffing Grime Dango. You can stack. Yes, you can. Didn't you say you need Mantis God? Not this time. Will it hit five? I think it just hits three. I think it overrides. I don't know if it does five. It might, though. We'll find out. The trapper sat hunched beside one of his open traps, slowly cranking it open. He gingerly removed a mangled hair from the steel teeth, but left the trap unhinged. You shouldn't have come here. Rest well, Mixed Dizzy. Okay. Watch this. We're gonna get the Ouroboros out. Ouroboros. Ouroboros. I don't know if I'm saying it correctly still. And we got a bat out the gate, too. The music is amazing. I mean, the music is unmatched. This game's music, this game's soundtrack is absurd. Just wait. Just you fucking wait. Oh, look! The Ouroboros got stronger! So now it's a 2-2. Two, two. We need another squirrel, though. We need two squirrels. We can use that to our advantage. Yeah, we can use this to crazy buff the Ouroboros. I'll try to do better better with pronunciation. I know everybody hates it when I pronounce, pronounce things bad. We could use the douse later. Let's wait. Lady Hopium, great to see you. We can kill the pelts. Oh yeah, hold on, let's do this. Let's get the pelts out of the deck real quick. I can just do this. So the Ouroboros, or, or the Ouro oh my god, the Ouroboros is gonna... Okay, so we can put a squirrel down and we can resummon the Ouroboros again. And now it's a 3-3. Three, three. Look at that. It's a 3 fucking 3. Oh, beautiful. It's getting so beefy. It's huge. I feel like we're farming this card up right now. It feels a little op to do. Shall we put the pronghorn out? Let's do it. Let's get the pronghorn out here. Yeah. Oh, wait, we can. Oh, wait a second. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. That's ridiculous. We have a 5-5. Five, five. Okay, watch this. Oh, this part's fun. Ah, it is the end of my turn. Whip, boonk. Let's trade. Wolf pelt. Okay, I hope you brought pelts because these creatures are prepared to rip your throat out. 
Trade for what you can, but know this. The rest will stay and fight for me. Okay, so we need to pick carefully. A bifurcated great white? We need this. We can't deal with this. A bifurcated rattler with tons of bones would also be good. But the poisonous grizzly is very difficult to deal with. We might want to get rid of the poisonous grizzly. We can kill a rattler really easily, but we can't kill a poisonous grizzly. Death touch grizzly? Um, I feel like getting rid of it is probably the right choice. Yeah. All right, well, that's all we can get, so that's hard. The amalgam, okay. All right, let's see how this goes for the first turn. So wait, this guy's gonna hit. Okay, let's see how this goes. So there we go. Perfect, that was perfect. That was literally perfect. That's exactly what we needed. So now we can go like this. And we need one more. Squirrel, okay. And then we're gonna go like this. We're gonna put the, the Ouroboros out. And then we're gonna put another squirrel out. And then we're gonna sacrifice three for the, for the shark. And then we're gonna put the Ouroboros back out, which is now a 6-6. Six, six. And then we can do this. We can put the bullfrog out too. I know, we built an op deck. The trapper is dead. He's already dead. Your lives are restored. Perhaps one of these will entice you. Mole Man Child 13 or the Strange Larva? We've never done Strange Larva. Child 13 is sick. But we've never done Strange Larva. Let's do Strange Larva. Come on. Now we have a problem here. You sneezed as the thick musk of pelts faded from the air. A sense of finality came over you as you moved toward a light in the distance. A moment. So, we could sacrifice a creature to the Bone Lord. Okay, we have to think carefully here. We still haven't gotten the magic eye yet, and we haven't discovered the other cr talking animal. So we're, we're going to have to do probably at least one more run before we get to chapter two. Here's some teeth we can use. I feel like we should try and see what the Bone Lord gives us. I don't, I, I don't remember what the Bone Lord gives you if you give him two sacrifices. However, this is just chapter one. Yes, we are still progressing through the story of chapter one. You'll see. I've been telling you. How long is this game? Shorter than you might think, but longer than you're expecting. There you go. Um. Let's see. Come on, let's do the Bone Lord. Come on. I want to find out what the Bone Lord does. A chill wind blew through the trading post. Its proprietor was now deceased. Still, you abided by the strange woman's rules as best as you could. Wait, what? Oh, this is the traitor. Oops. Oops. That wasn't the Bone Lord. Oh, I'm stupid. That was the trait that was the trapper or the traitor, not the Bone Lord. Oops. Sorry, guys. My own bad. Surely this cabin marked the end of your travails. We're probably gonna lose against him, but I'm not sure. We might be able to beat the moon this time. Let's see what happens.
It's really funny. The first time I played this game, it took me fucking forever to get here. Will you earn my bone, my boons, traveler? The trial of rarity. The three drawn cards must include a rare card. The trial of the swift. It must include a sprinter sigil. The trial of the finned. Well, we know it has to be the rare card. We have multiple rare cards. The trial of rarity. There we go. Wait. Not a single rare card. Oh, Grime Dango doesn't count as a rare. Failure. Ooh. The trial of the ring. Well, we do have that. The trial of the skins. The trial of the winged. Well, we have the ring, so we win. We get the ring. I almost missed your ring from up here. You pass. The boon of the bone lord. You will start a battle with eight bones. The boon of the goat's blood. You will start a battle with the black goat on the board. The boon of the magpie's eyes. I want bone lord. Right? Magpie is OP. It is true. Wait, wait, wait. We need to do the magpie because that gives us Grime Dango. All right, here we go. You managed to get a boon. This may be a fair competition. Here we go. What's the difference between a Garbanzal bean and a Magpie? Here we go. Are you ready? Yes, Leshy, I'm ready. Let's do this. This will be your final test. Another flame. A Garbin's Albium? Get the strange larva out right away. We can get a stink bug out right away. Which will survive. And we can put out the greater smoke. I love this song. Oh, we got the strange pupa. Okay. The trifurcated Grime Dango is out into our hands. That's a good sign. Here we go. He killed all three. What a fucking piece of shit. it through uh through fights so the grime dango can go here and we'll kill everything oh no it won't oh shit no it will not because it's only oh i forgot grime dango only does two damage hold on i got this i got this i got this here we go here we go here we go here we go there we go we got this we got this we got this we're good phase two baby phase fucking two baby phase two baby and if you can believe it, it's phase two once again. For you knew somehow that the worst was yet to come. M magnificent death cards. Perhaps you will join them soon. Anathema, Calliope. Amalgam out. Did 
did I have to give the game info? I gave the game info. We got a deer in chat. I know. Fucking sick, right? We, we can write Re Leshy in. I don't know if it does anything, but we can try it. We will definitely write Leshy in if we win. Yeah, but you did it really early on. I don't know if that matters, but... All right, we're on to the moon. Phase three, baby. Let's do it. Deer are out all year these days. Yeah, it's sick. We live in the age of deer. Humans are fucked. If you, if you want to live in the future, you need to learn to become a deer. Humans got to get better at becoming animal. Will you dare attack the moon? We don't have- Oh, we used the hook. Fuck, I forgot we were supposed to save the hook. Shit. Yeah, we might be able to do that. Hold on. Wait, we need more than- We need one more squirrel. Put the mirror out. Oh, there we got a free squirrel. Oh my god, watch. Watch this. Wait a minute, we're gonna do the cheesiest bullshit again? <laughs> we're doing the cheesy shit again? Melanoe Astarte, Eurydice. Watch this, I wanna do this. I wanna one shot the moon. I wanna one turn the moon. I think we got an infinite loop. All right, we're one-shotting the moon, everybody. We're one-shotting the moon, everyone. Look at the bones. Look at the bone stack. <laughs> what the hell? In, in fucking incredible. This is amazing. I love that there are so many ways that you can find to break this game. It's so much fun. Yes, I am the I am the dark queen of the cards. Beating Leshy at his own game. Twenty-seven, we're almost there, everybody. We're almost there, everybody. Bone stack is ready, baby. I am the bone lord now. I have usurped the god of death. Leshy, I am your death. Uh, the bones are broken, everybody. The bones are actually broken. You can hear the bones. Uh, the bones are broken. Okay, I'll work on farming that up. Here's what I'll do, everybody. I'll work. Hold on, I got an idea. I got an idea. I will work on farming up that achievement off stream, and then when I'm about to get the achievement, I'll do it on stream. Does that make sense? Okay, everybody. We have it. The 40 damage Ouroboros. Are we ready? First, we're gonna take out our tooth so he compliments us. And now we're gonna fucking clock him. Here it goes. Boom! Do you have any idea the consequences of destroying an astral body? No, of course not. Finish this. <laughs> Guys, playing this
this through together has been so good. <laughs> We've broken this game so much and I didn't even mean to I've just been trying to show you the game and we keep breaking it. It's so good. Oh My god. Oh Leshy having bested the cabin's inhabitant you were invited to sit The great scribe regaled you with his stories He told you of a world long past of how he had conquered it Wait a minute, this is another different ending. I've never seen this ending either. Of how pure his true intentions were. How he only wished. Enough. Eat. Are you pleased? Eat it. I will not dwell on a rejected gift. Right through here. Stand there. It's useless without the film. I do not wish to forget your victory, and so I would like to prepare a monument to it. Please inscribe your name. Here we go, Leshy. You clip the bone noises? Leshy. Say still for me. You should be very proud of yourself. <laughs>